Right now, though, we are joined by the incredible Ruth Turnbull, a World Masters Games and Masters Weightlifting Oceanas, I think, Pacific Rim Tournament and World Cup Gold Medalist and World Record Holder as well to help inspire us all to stay fit and active and try something new no matter what age. Good morning, Ruth. Hi, Mel. So firstly... How is Holly as a neighbour? Is she really loud and annoying? Do you I hear you probably all the time? need quite a lot of time to tell you about yeah, it. Yeah, we'll do that on another show. So, I think. Yeah, it can take a whole show. Yeah, I'm mm. sure it would. Well, congratulations on your success because you. it must be hard to sleep with that next door. Too. <laughs> but um, congratulations. Um, does it shock people when you tell them that your gold medals are in weightlifting? Pretty much. Um, it does get a bit of a look because they don't imagine that weightlifters are this age and you know sort of tall. Yes, so, you exactly. Know, you kind of have this the vision of sort of the, the, the weightlifts is like this. Mm. And if you don't mind us um, asking, what division, what age division are you in? What sort <laughs> okay. of weightlifting do you do? I'm in the 65 to 69 age group, and uh, you're also in a weight group. So I'm in the 75 kilo to 90 kilo weight bracket. And so what sort of weight can you actually lift or do okay. you lift? Okay, so it's, um, it's done with a combination of a clean and jerk and a snatch, and it's the combined weights of both those lifts. So I did the record, um, got the record at 78 kilos. How much, sorry? 78. So that was a 44 clean and jerk and a 34 snatch. The snatch is when you go... Snatch is straight up. Straight up. And the and clean and jerk, jerk is when you go under and, and up. up. I've done a pump class or two. I can... Yes. Yeah, it's yes. not with that much weight, though. I can yeah. tell you that off the hat. Wow, that's incredible. Um, what did it feel like when you won and broke a record as well? <laughs> well, it was a bit surreal. I, I've just recently got the certificate acknowledging the record. And it's, it's not something I planned to do. I didn't... This wasn't my life goal. But to be a weightlifter? Yes, yes, funny that, but it's been fun. So and when did you start or how did you get um, into it? I started just under two years ago. We started just before the Masters were coming to New Zealand. So did you look at the Masters and go, OK, I want to do yeah, something in do it? Yeah, something there. Yeah. Why weightlifting? Well, I'd been powerlifting because I have exercised for about 35 years fairly regularly mm. and I've done resistance training. And I have a personal trainer, so I'm lucky to be able to have that. So you're and, fit? Yeah, yeah mm. so I'm pretty fit. And he said to me, well, there's no, um, there's no powerlifting in the game, so we will do Olympic weightlifting. And I said, oh, OK. You know. So what's powerlifting? Powerlifting is the three combinations of a, clear, of a deadlift, a bench press and a squat. Gosh, I didn't know there was so much involved oh, in that. No, it's technical. So have you always been a competitive athlete? When I was very young, when I was at school, but not, I'm quite competitive, I think, so people tell me, in career and life. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, so I'm competitive anyway, and so this just added another dimension. Well, obviously, in two years in the sport, and you win, a, you win medals, and you also get a record as well. Yeah, the lady I was up against in Gold Coast, she's been lifting for 34 years. Oh, and that must uh, have really ripped her nighty. Yeah, yeah. Well, oh, there you are there, fantastic. Yeah, she's lovely. You are? a lot taller than she is though. Yes, she's a good build for a weightlifter. Mm. So do people look at you and see your tallness and think, oh, she's no threat? I'm not sure there's such a lovely community. The weightlifting community is the kindest, nicest group of people you could ever meet. So I mean, they never judge. Don't they? No. How wonderful. Yeah, it's lovely. How long did you train for the Masters or um, before you started competing? I trained three days a week and... That's all I need to train, you know, once you get to a certain age. Mm. And I keep mentioning age. It's not really about age. I just need to say that. You yeah. can do anything. But it's, there's a neural memory and everything and all of that kind of stuff, you know, all that mm. technical stuff. So, well, I was yeah. reading somewhere that you should actually train less sometimes because it is better for you because your, otherwise your body starts producing too much cortisol or something. Oh, that's my, my trainer says so something like that. Yeah, so it's yeah. not like, but my yeah. physio did too, but she yeah. did it a lot more technical than you were just talking about. You don't about. have to be technical. So this medal here, this is your gold from the the gold from the Masters in Auckland, mm -hmm. and yeah. And what are these other ones that you've got here as well? So one of those is uh, Oops, Pan Pacific, um, Pan Pacific Rim, Oceania, and World Cup Masters. And there was a fourth, which was the Australian Masters, but of course we can't go into that. <laughs> so, so what would you say to people who are watching this and maybe thinking, oh, that's, that's something I could do, or I might like to do. How would you encourage them? I would just say do it, because it is such fun. And there are weightlifting gyms that just specialise in weightlifting. I go to 
the Auckland Council gym, I go to Glenfield Leisure Centre and that's fine. But it is such an interesting thing to do. As I said, the community's really supportive. And even though in competition you have to wear a terrible suit that I do like into it. Well, you and rowing, you've got a mate, haven't you? That's right, <laughs> exactly. But so anyway, that's what there. we do. Oh, yep, that's, oh, you, oh look, yeah. you make it look great. <laughs> so are you still competing? I am going to be, I was going to retire, but I'm going in the New Zealand Masters in December and there's uh, the World Masters Weightlifting in Montreal next August. So do you try, are you going to try and break your own record? I think so, because it only has to be a couple of kilos. Why so not? So keep going, why not? Exactly. Yeah. Well, it looks like you're enjoying it and you're doing incredibly well at it. Thank it's you fun. so much for stopping by. Thank you. We'll have a coffee and get all the goss from about later good. on. good. Yeah. Thank you so okay. much, Ruth. And all the very best in Canada as well. Thank you. We'll see you back here with another, another medal after that. You will.